Yo, what's going on everyone? Welcome back to YK Recreation. I'm sure you've seen enough of this red Subaru now and you're guessing where has the blue purple Subaru gone? But it's not gone nowhere, it's still here. It's the only problem we had was we thought this was just going to be a simple maintenance, you know, on the red Subaru, but obviously not, it needed a lot more bits doing. Yeah, so it's time to start on this purple one. It's going to be exciting, but it's going to be fun at the same time. I'm dreading it slightly because I know how much work it's going to need. It's going to need everything changing, but we'll go through it together. Also, it'd be good to know how many Subaru people we've got in here. If you've had Subarus in the past or if you even actually own a Subaru, what Subaru do you own? Or what Subaru have you owned? Drop it in the comment section below and we can all get together and share our ideas when we're repairing this one. So yeah, that'd be good to know. So let's go see how bad it is inside. Let's see how bad this is. Oh my god. It's mold everywhere. Good job, it's got leather seats in it. If it didn't have leather seats, we'd be in trouble. So, what I'm gonna use is, yeah, fungicide. Fungicidal wash kills and inhibits growth of mold and algae. Oh, I need to put some gloves on first. Bloody hell, man. No one, this fungi thing all over me. Quite good this eh? It's taking the fungi off straight away. Mm. The rest of it looks pretty clean. I was a bit shocked to be fair. It's a bit shocking. Spider webs there. I'm not scared of spider webs. No. Forget spider webs. Be alright. You can survive this. Right. Time to get the battery in it and see if it starts up. Because this seat's alright. To be honest, I thought I'm going to jump in here. This is going to be so dirty, yeah. I won't be able to sit in it <laughs> on the seat you've literally got this much mold let's test the battery first see if it has even any power if it has charged no point putting it in and the battery is dead 13.23 I've just literally took it off charge now so as you can see the voltage is dropping but if you get in the car quick this should fire up the car Right. So the moment of truth. Bismillah rahman rahim. Can hear it sucking fuel. Yes. And just like that, it's alive. And it's died again. I think it's run out of fuel. What did I do? I know it's got enough oil in it because I checked it that day, but 
Oh, why have you died? Why have you died? It's alive, it's alive. It's got a misfire. It's got a bad misfire. I think it's low on fuel, you know. The fuel, the fuel needle's not moved. Yeah. It looks like it's really low on fuel. That's why it's keep turning off. So I'm gonna have to go get some fuel, I think. Let's try it again. Fires up. He's got a very bad misfire. He's got a very bad misfire. Yeah, it sounds like he's got a very bad misfire. I'm gonna give it a little rest, I don't wanna burn out the starter. This was running before. This is big back up. I don't want to run. It's got, it's got a big misfire. See if all the coil. Can't see anything now. Only thing is these clubs here are kind of wet. You know, the coil pack ones, they've got like oil and stuff in them. Let's try it again. Make sure this pipe's still on. Yeah, that pipe's still on. Yeah. That pipe is still on. Um, either that or I'm thinking that actual fuel pump has gone wet. Let me just check underneath. Can't see any fuel leaking under there. Can see loads of smoke, but no fuel. So the fuel's not leaking, that's just water dripping. Hmm. Strange one. I think the fuel pump's had it. But you can hear the fuel pump. Must have, I don't know. Spark plugs or something. I've gone rusted. Something's gone wrong somewhere. <sighs> See, like it wants to fire up. No. Try one last time. If not, I'm gonna take the uh, spark plug wires out and give them a clean. This has definitely got a misfire. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna spray a bit of contact cleaner, electric contact cleaner. This is for like electric plugs and stuff. Stay on these plugs. That really dirty and mucky these wires look really stiff as well as if they've been stood for ages yeah 
the wires do look really brittle 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 that sounds worse so it does sound like the spark plug related no the switch here because i can smell fuel there's enough fuel again And then see how bad they are. Does not want to start. Let's try again one last time. We're just gonna flood it. Yeah, we're just gonna flood it. If you wanted to start, it start up. So yeah, there you go. The blue so blue is already projects problems have already started. That it's not even firing up now. So we're gonna have to change spark plugs. I think um, tester coil packs. It can be. It can be a few things, but. You're gonna have to you're gonna have to wait and see see if we can get keep get this back alive so until next time <laughs>